Let's check it out. Number one, flag the music for 10 seconds. You can make this a weekly goal, a daily goal. Press music, play some music, and then plank for 10 seconds. Then stop. Goal one. Tomorrow, you can plank for 30 seconds. But if it's too much, you can go back to 10 seconds. So 30 seconds. Plank to music. The technique here is don't just plank. Pick a song that you love and play. 10 seconds. Very good. 30 seconds. Plank again for 60 seconds. Plank for 120 seconds. Plank for 240 seconds. Plank for the whole duration of the song. You're slowly developing your muscles. Instead of focusing on the pain, you're focusing on, I love this song. Okay, I've never seen people advise the other people to plank up to music. Okay, next. Learn one new stretch a month. If you don't incorporate it in your day-to-day. -day. Like, for example, you've been working for two hours, so marketing leg more. What do you do? You do this, diba? Right? Figure out a new stretch, and maybe you can do that instead. Next time, you need to stretch. You apply your new stretch. Learn a new stretch or not. And that stretch, you add it to your daily stretch habit. Every time you do a stretching, find out a brand new stretch and do it as a habit, not as... I'm going to exercise now. No, don't do that. Just do it whenever you feel like stretching or make it a habit. Like when you wake up, your brand new stretches. <clears throat> the novelty of the new stretch will help your brain from complaining about, I don't want to exercise. Let's go. <laughs> Create a random time daily stretch habit. <clears throat> Number two, I have to cook one new thing a month. A lot of our joy as humans is what we eat. And if you're not old enough, you're still excited to go to restaurants <clears throat> to discover new food. But once you're old enough and you have tasted everything, <laughs> it's now time to develop your skills of cooking. Because you can only eat so much steak. And most of the steak that they sell is marketing, no? Lincoln <laughs> steak. When you taste it, what's this? So it's just really marketing. Learn to cook one new thing a month. That's for you, for your physical life. Okay. Now get a paid trainer in areas you are not good at. I hope these ideas are helping you think about uh, planning next year in a different way. Okay. So just to remind you, January 20 is my mini planning session with content creation. You get to bring a friend or a assistant for the January 20 Metro Manila mini planning and content creation session. This part here, uh, the stuff I'm giving you are just ideas that you can put in your plan. So you can sit down two hours in that space. You can plan stuff there. And then while you're doing that, you can discuss with your virtual assistant, apply the lessons that I will teach, which is which are video marketing tools that they can do on the, uh, on the spot. So both of you will bring a laptop, an extra piece of paper, ganyan, ganyan. a planning session there. You can learn the skill of the video marketing or you split up. One person does the uh, video marketing application because this content creation is for video. I can look at your planning things. Okay? We're all be doing discussions in so People will be sharing their experience in planning. And uh, our 20 live event, Taguig City, uh, Gaia Center in BCDA, Versi 5 in Taguig, not uh, in BGC. You need to bring a laptop, internet connection, and snacks. Now, January 20, my workshop on planning and content creation for video. And venue is Ligaya Center. Now, before I go to mine, goes, I want to discuss how to join an uh, event. Lila, huh? okay. so, no. Question, how many books do you want to read this year? Discover new genres of reading you haven't read about before. Because I was only reading success literature. You know, and grow rich and stuff. Sad for that. And then marketing books like magnetic marketing. Okay. Maybe you can expand your reading into psychology or philosophy. In my case, philosophy. I went into philosophy. 
and also ancient books like a hundred years old books, two hundred years old books, uh, one thousand five hundred year old books. No kidding, they're free online anyway. I've been reading that. They're translated. Uh, English is old, so I asked ChatGPT to uh, make me a modern version of this section. 